And with January 1st quickly approaching, so is the start of legal recreational marijuana sales. And the Department of Revenue is updating its marijuana regulations. But more changes could still be on the way. MTN's Jonathan Ambarian breaks it all down for us. With just three weeks left before recreational marijuana sales begin in Montana, state lawmakers say they want to take a little more time to go through the rules that are going to govern those sales. On Thursday, the Economic Affairs Interim Committee voted to informally object to the current rule proposals from the Montana Department of Revenue. That will delay the rulemaking process for a few days, while lawmakers talk with the department to take a closer look at the proposals. Since this is, you know, such an important issue for the state of Montana. It's our obligation to make sure it is 100% accurate, 100% within the intent of the legislature, that our legislative intent is met for the people of Montana. Senator Jason Ellsworth, a Republican from Hamilton, says it's not a fight and the department has done a lot of good work on the rules, but he still has some concerns about issues like outdoor growing and labeling requirements. Democratic Senator Shane Morajo of Missoula had questions on the rules for licenses that will be offered to tribes, as well as the fees charged to providers. I think we're very close, um, but I, I think we just need some, um, some minor refinement to get this right here, right down the gate. The department already presented some proposed amendments to the rules during Thursday's meeting. They removed a provision that would prohibit marijuana dispensaries from selling CBD oil and other products derived from hemp. And they eliminated a section that advocates worried would keep a person with a criminal conviction of any kind from working for marijuana businesses. We enjoyed seeing a reversal of those extremely restrictive regulations that were obviously strayed far from the intent of the legislation. The goal is to have regulations finalized before Christmas so they can be in place for January 1st. Though many people at Thursday's meeting acknowledge there will be more to deal with even after sales begin. I'd say, you know, we've got sales starting in three weeks and to expect the unexpected. Lawmakers will be talking to the Department of Revenue over the weekend. The committee will meet again on Monday where they could decide to lift the informal objection. In Helena, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News.